Oklahoma City Public Schools tells me pre-K enrollment is vital to student success. They tell me prior to the pandemic, they had nearly 2,600 students enrolled, but that number has dropped drastically over the last few years. Oh, good. Okay, I'm going to give you some paper now. It's not just about um, that one year. Oftentimes pre-K is setting kiddos up for success uh, that lasts their lifetime. And then put your mustache on him. Kids that attend pre-K going into kindergarten have a smoother transition than those that do not attend pre-K. We're going to take the mustache. Although pre-K isn't mandatory in Oklahoma, OKCPS says they offer full day learning for little ones. A lot of it comes down to learning those social emotional skills, how to get along with others, how to work in a group, um, how to follow directions. Those skills are really being sharpened at uh, four years old. Take your hands and smooth it saying the success stories are all in the research. And children that have high quality early learning opportunities are uh, more likely to hold down a, a stable job, um, have increased incomes. All right, I love it, I love it, I love it. Okay. For those parents having a hard time deciding if it's the right decision or simply letting go. Have lots of really great meaningful conversations with your kids if this is the first time they're especially going to be away from you. Now, we're, I'm going to give you a marker. Don't drag out the goodbye on the first day. That is the other biggest mistake I think that some of our parents do. They're having a harder time letting go sometimes. See y'all next time. Families not in OKC school district, you can still enroll your little learners. That transfer window is open now until April 15th.